The vision is to be a regulator of excellence, promoting the growth and development of the financial services sector of St. Lucia. The Financial Services Regulatory Authority, FSRA, founded in 2014, is responsible for overseeing various sectors within St. Lucia's financial industry, including insurance, credit unions, money services, the international financial sector, and the virtual asset business sector. The dynamic global financial landscape has propelled the FSRA to develop a new strategic plan with an updated vision, mission, and core values. Natalie DeSose, Executive Director at the FSRA, said the development of the strategic plan, vision, mission, and core values was a result of a collaborative effort with the board of directors, the management team, and staff of the FSRA. I believe it is the critical time for us to be visible especially because of our mandate of safeguarding policyholders and deposit-taking institutions. And therefore, we believe that the strategic plan will allow us to navigate through that ever-evolving and changing financial landscape. And therefore, a new mission, vision, and core values will definitely give us the necessary tools for us to navigate those times that I will call stressful moments for the financial sector. Chair of the Board of Directors of the FSRA, Philip Dalsu, noted that the new strategic plan is in keeping with good governance principles to ensure that the FSRA carries out its core responsibilities efficiently and effectively. He said this is in conformance with the Public Finance Management Act, which mandates that all statutory bodies prepare a strategic plan in collaboration with the Department of Finance. The strategic plan is really a document that charts the way forward for the organization. It essentially provides a direction of where the organization wants to head in the future. And this is a, a very important document that all organizations should have, and in particular the Financial Services Regulatory Authority. Staff of the FSRA were fully immersed in the creation and unveiling of a signature wall publicly portraying the logo, vision, mission, and core values embedded in the strategic plan. The core values of integrity, transparency, professionalism, and accountability were stressed by Dr. Harvey Miller, who facilitated a half-day workshop with staff on the core principles of the strategic plan. A part of my philosophy is that uh, your strategic plan should be a stakeholder-driven strategic plan. And by that I mean that you need to engage all the people who have a vested interest in you succeeding. And then we also wanted to get a sense from all those key stakeholders, what was their vision of success or what is their vision of success for the FSRA? Because ultimately you are successful if you realize the vision of success of your key stakeholders. Dr. Miller emphasized that the strategic plan is a living document that requires regular reviews, adjustments, and active engagement with stakeholders. It should be an evolving guide that will influence the actions and decisions of the FSRA for years to come. For the National Competitiveness and Productivity Council, Glenn Simon reporting.